Here's a quick video of the Panther engine before I install the surge tank and the gas tank. The drive shafts that drive the fan drives are installed. There's a dipstick for each fan drive gearbox. There's one on each side. Also the ventilation system to pull the hot air from away from the exhaust manifolds. And then there's plumbing. Most all of the plumbing has been installed to interconnect all four radiators to the engine. There's a total of 96 hose clamps or junctions that tie all this together. There's hose clamps all over the place. This upper hose here attaches to the surge tank and the lower hose there attaches to the bottom of the surge tank. It's also the blowtorch heater is in place. That uh, was a method of using a, a blowtorch to heat the coolant for a cold start. Also has um, all four carburetors are hooked up and that valve on the back there is a valve that cuts off the fuel flow if the oil pressure drops. So there's an, oil line, there's an oil pressure line that goes from the governor housing to the top of that valve and it automatically shuts the fuel flow off. 